We're getting ready to roll. Back in the days, uh, I was singing with uh, our lead singer for Cool in the Game. They were just getting started. Time, time is uh, a very slippery thing. That's the reason why people, and they're young, man, they gotta be real focused. I try to tell my son to be his focus. My biggest thing when I was his age, when I was younger than him, brother, a guy told me a long time ago, he said, uh, my anxiety is what was going to destroy me. I was so anxious about getting things done. That's one of the reasons why I didn't last with cool them. I was so anxious. Man, those guys back in those days, they were so patient, so laid back. They would finish the show. The first thing they want to do was think, hey, man, how can we make the next show better? And I thought, I thought that was, I thought it was crazy, man. Come off a stage and you want to go back to a dress room and talk about it, make the next show better. I thought when you come off, the, come get out of the dress room, man, you go in, uh, relax, chill out of the bar and stuff, and just make it. But when they came off a stage, they would go to the dress room. All of them would go to the dress room and start. They, said, they call it. They used to call it skull busting. They used to go to the dress room and they would, um, they would talk about what they went with, how to make the next set stronger. They were really a band. show man like like the was a terrible storm and everything just quietened down I feel like I just woke up but the whole time before the show and when I'm on stage the closer I get to the end of the show I can see the light at the end of the so tunnel. You don't really dig it then. Let me tell you what it is man. When I go on stage believe it or not man it's all about us giving my soul up. This is what it be. Yeah. Giving my soul up, man. I mean, every word I say, man, my life is going in every syllable. It's like a painful pleasure. Yeah. If it, hey, man, if I go on stage, man, and I didn't get that feeling, sometimes I go on stage and I don't get that feeling. I don't get that feeling, I'll be mad as hell. Yeah. Because I didn't get the fear. Yeah. See, I hold a great reverence for, for, for what I do. And, 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 and so by doing that, man, I have to fear. I fear. Yeah. I dread, I, and in, in the terms of, of all, you know, mm -hmm. in the terms of all, man, so. It's heavy. Of this new world again. The best of new cars. Imagine in the stars. Mistaken solution to our
man, I had a good time and uh, really enjoyed it. Really enjoyed it. Listen, and then that now that um that it's over, I'm getting ready to relax, like the Jersey. And uh, but it was fun, definitely fun. I think at this point, whatever, similar to um, me being able to survive all these years without a real big record. Because I caught on to it happening a long time ago. But what happened was I didn't I didn't have that technology in my hand. But I studied. So the reason why I'm in the game at this age, still in the game. Because I understand technology very well. I'm very um, observant on the changes with the new artists, what they're doing, and I know how they're doing it. So I think right now, I think in America, in my latter years, I think I'm going to be taken very serious. They didn't take me serious in the beginning over here. They took me serious in Europe uh, in the beginning. But I think they're going to take me very serious um, in, in latter times because there's no way they can annoy me.